Today I received a package. Oh, it's from Spin Masters. Oh, special cubes. <laughs> it's the Bob Ross cube. Hi, my name is Flo and welcome to my rotating puzzle collection. I have over 2000 cubes at home and 1519 unique cubes. My first cube 16 years ago, I found this cube in a box in the Arctic when I moved. And after then I always looking for a new challenge and new cubes and now I have many new challenges. This one is the smallest in my collection and it also works. And from the smallest one, we came to the biggest one. It works. I have here a special one. It's from the first series from 1977. It was made in Hungary. Really special one. People often ask me about my favorite cube, uh, but I don't have one favorite group. I have a shelf complete with my special cubes and also on this side. This one is a prototype from Anno Rubik. If he hadn't invaded the cube in uh, 1974 in Hungary, I wouldn't have this record now. Uh, so thank you, Mr. Rubik. This one, this was the Rubik's Connect. Uh, you can connect it with uh, app. The newest cube in my collection was the Rubik's Phantom. Rubik's Phantom is the first cube with heat sensitive surface that make the colors visible by touch. Well, many people uh, ask me how much is my uh, collection, um, but hey. <laughs> <laughs> the collection's value is priceless. But when I have to speak uh, about money, I can say uh, it's a new car, a small car. Ah, Harry Potter. I find my cubes at shops, at markets, traveling the internet. Kingdom Hearts. I have also uh, written to companies. It would be nice if the manufacturers would send me now, after my record, some cubes. Rick and Marty. Okay. It make it easier and it make it cheaper for me. Please send me cubes. I think I have also infected my family with solving the Rubik's Cube and everyone can solve the cube. As a child I only turned the cube a little bit. After then, um, when I was 24, I solved for the first time uh, the Rubik's Cube. Today I see the cube as a problem and the problem I can fix it. And this attitude also has a positive effect on my life. Even as a child I was reading uh, the books and now I'm a part of this history with my crazy cube collection. But there are so many other variations of cubes in uh, the world and in my collection. So I can keep collecting for the next few years until one day my house will be too small.